Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn about Terraform Lookup function. Lookup is one of my favorite function to use with Terraform while writing the infrastructure as a code. Let's say we have this storage account code to create a storage account in Azure. Here you can see that I am using the storage account attributes as a hard coded values. So there are multiple options I can use these values for example I can provide these values with the help of parameters like this and this works fine in case of some resources which you are creating it and you are passing the variable now if you go to the Azure portal and try to create a storage account let's say sample stabc something like that you can see that we have got the Reason automatically selected, performance automatically selected, redundancy is automatically selected. If I go to these settings, these are also automatically selected. So basically, Azure portal is saying that these are the properties which I'll be selecting on your behalf, but you have a freedom to choose from your configuration. If you want to make changes, you can make it. Otherwise, these are the default settings which I would like to set it up while creating this particular resource type and you'll find the same pattern in almost all the resource types so that while creating resources in Azure portal you would require less effort to you know set all these values because some of the values are basically optional or it would have at least some default values to go ahead and create a resource similarly if you would like to write the Terraform code wherein you provide a similar kind of experience to your users to, to your program which would have an option to specify the property or if they, even though if it, they, they do not specify the property you have option to set those property default in those cases I always prefer to use a lookup type of function so how do I do that let's see that let's see so in such cases what do I do is I create a attribute I create a parameter called config and with the config I go ahead and specify let's say this is my config type so I'm going to say or I can call it as in a storage config for example and here I can say it is going to be standard account replication type as an LRS okay and now when I'm going to use this I'm going, I can use it like account here and config dot account so now we are using the config attribute and we are providing config dot account here replication and some other properties but again you will say we are using this attributes explicitly so it means that whoever is providing the config object they have to specify this these two properties without that your code will not work we can use the lookup function like lookup and we know that this is lookup expect first argument as in map type of object and we know that this config is a map type which has different key value pair so from this map object we are looking for this property if it has the property value it will read the value of that property which is well and good this is what we want and if it doesn't have the value you can use the lookup function like this or you can use the lookup functions like this wherein we are saying if it doesn't have the property available then use the, this particular default value so this is a two different flavor of lookup function first one find the property use the value second one find the property from from this map find this property if the property is not available use this default value and that's how you provide your user Azure portal like experience wherein you are basically 
providing a default value for your resources. As you can see that we have the story account program running and these are some default values it is expect it is setting up for example I'm changing the value from default to RGRS to LRS and anytime if I would like to overwrite the value I can basically override it from this function because the default value is GRS which is this one but we are passing the value as an LRS which is taking a precedence and that's the reason it is showing like that the storage account is going to recreate because we are passing the value so if I ignore this value for example I just don't pass the config I'll pass this config as an empty for example in that case basically it will search the attribute from this empty config values if it doesn't find it will fill in this default values for you and that's the reason it is really important to learn this function because if you want to write a dynamic program for your infrastructure code using the Terraform then this is going to be really helpful. I hope you understand how to use lookup function. If you find it helpful please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already thanks for watching it see you in the next video.